welcome back to the channel so we got another video we finished up the uh, earlier today finished up this install that's the other video we got spark a guard installed faster mini shift shaft brace and the new packs, packs racing uh, shift lever so that'll be another video I'll have that uploaded pretty soon go check it out but now we got probably my part part favorite part I've been waiting on let's check this out we're gonna do bars check it out so we got the new DBK ODI bars cam DBK grip donuts that's what's up ODI grips so yes yeah, so I kind of already started the install so I took the brake cable off here the stock one I got this all loose I'm getting ready to pull this whole throttle assembly apart and I'm gonna move this guy down here on the new bars because these bars have more room here so that'll go there yeah I want to show you guys this so look at the length okay they're same here these cables look at the length difference there's a bit more slack on the BBR cables so and then I got the throttle assembly which will route down through here gotta try and remember where this goes down through here and then we'll take I already got this cover loose and uh Let's take this cover off real quick show you guys. That just comes out like that. Then you can get to your throttle cable pieces. We got these screws out. These are just going to come apart like this. Okay, then you take this here. Should pop out like that. It just pops out. There's your stock throttle tube. All right, guys, figure these out. So you just take this, back this nut off, tightens against these. These little deals just screw off, and you'll reuse them. Then you run your cables down through here, so the new ones will be the exact same. This one will run, so the one with the nut, the extra one, goes closest to you on the front of the bike. So. Yeah, now we'll get these off and then I run figure it out. So he's loosen these here and it lets these loose. So the the end of the smaller threads, that one's gonna go towards the front right here. There we go. Should we pull that guy through? Try and get that guy through there. Should go this way? Make sure we see where it's routed. So it goes right up through there. And that's it. Let's pull that guy through. There's that guy. Next. So, bigger threads. Goes towards the back. Let's do this guy. Pull the slack. Should pop out. There we go. That slides out of there like that. We should be able to pull this guy through. There we go. Now, stock cables are out. We can install the new BBRs. So let's do that right now. We got the new BBR extended cables routed. Let's tighten these throttle cables up. Got them routed the same as the stock. Imagine they don't get to be that tight. Let's imagine this top here. They're pretty tight. Alright. We got those nice and snugged up, lined up, routed through the exact same way, up and through. See how much longer they are. So, yeah, next we're going to get this guy apart, I'm pretty much already do, and then 
get the bars taken off and we'll go from there. Alrighty, got the BBR extended uh, brake cable back on, got it looped through there, 12 millimeter uh, nuts tied back up, got this little clamp holds the cable back on, threaded it through, it'll go right into the bars. So yeah, super simple. Already started loosening these up. These are a 10 millimeter to pull your bars off. So yeah, we're gonna pull these off and then we'll put the new ones on. Right on. We got the bars in. These look so they look a lot better. Uh -huh. So what I did, come back over here and show you guys. So got these on. These little numbers here, you can adjust them forwards or backwards. What I did, I just lined up the third mark on each side and they sit right against the clamp. Probably a half of a whatever off, so, but they're pretty straight. So, yeah, next we're going to install my new ODI grips and now these I picked gray because I thought it'd be cool I did the new V2 lock-on system you do not need um, glue or anything it just uses that to lock it down I came with came with all these extra cams for your uh, throttle right doesn't come with a 19 plus CRF 110 so <laughs> so you have to order cam R I believe it is yeah no yeah right there you can read that V2 cam R for a Honda CRF 110 18 plus yeah they came with them but not for the 19 CRF 110 so got the throttle cam it'll go on here so it's got cam B on there yeah if that guy just oh sweet yeah so that just comes off like that and you'll snap the new throttle cam on there but right now let's go this is the other side grip oh. kept it on there with the freaking instructions on there shit yeah. well, right so we got the Left side grip, just loosen that guy up a little bit. Let's see if you can focus here. Loosen that guy up a little bit. And then you just push this guy. And then you just put it wherever you want it. And you'll take this guy. Their V2 system doesn't use any glue or anything. Let's take this guy. Hold the camera. Just tighten that guy up. Just tighten this guy up, and your grip's good to go. So now, let's do the throttle side. All right, guys, got a lot done off camera. It's kind of a pain in the ass trying to get this throttle cam R on. Once you have these hooked on the inside, you have to snap the throttle cam back on. It's kind of a pain in the ass. You get the grip where you want it, but yeah, grips on, good to go. Good to go there. All tightened up. Got the shorty brake lever on. It's a lot better. The brake cable hooked back up. Gonna wait on this guy. We're from the finishing touches. Looks good. Throttle cables all routed down. I moved this down here good to go with that gonna go there so now we just got finishing touch which is this guy we are done got them on pretty good Got the crossbar pad on, ODI, DBK, ha, 
finishing touches the DBK grip donuts focus you bastard yeah they look pretty good yeah these bars look super duper duper good I like it so what we're gonna do Hopefully next. Or oh we might do plastics, I don't know yet. Alrighty, make sure this thing is good. I'm about to adjust these cables a little bit. to adjust them a little bit. That's right. So we're gonna get this cover back on and that'll be it. So yeah we're gonna get these probably these cables adjusted see if they're bound up somewhere or something. See if this guy's a little tight. I don't know. Turns back super slow, so I don't know. So, so that is the install, guys. They look super duper good. Super happy with it. So, yeah, it's the install ODI handlebars, DBK. So, yeah. Thanks for watching, and uh, like I say, check out the previous video, the shift lever and uh, sprocket guard, shift shaft brace. So, yeah. So, that's it. Thanks for watching. We'll see you guys next time. Later.